What's going on guys, Nogaleo back with some more Pokemon Scarlet. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, Pokemon Scarlet. Um, so now we can roam around the school finally. Let's go ahead and go to the cafeteria. I was actually not even intending to uh, record. I am orange as hell. I didn't even intend to record this right away. As soon as I did, I was actually trying to trade over my team uh, from a friend or whatever, but I do have to complete this portion of the game to get access to the Poke Portal. So, or I can't use the Poke Portal in the school and I can't even get out of the school. So, yeah. Uh, oh, hey, so we meet again. You remember me, right? Yeah. yeah exactly. That's my little know it all, buddy. Got a mine like a steel trap, eh? He's about to uh, give us access to the Titans. No need to tell me your name. Kiriko, right? Oh, the school seems to be talking about you. The new kid who showed up uh, with the president of the student council. They over there eating sandwiches and shit. I normally wouldn't even bother showing up for class, but I came all the way to school today just to talk with you, our new celebrity. Damn, you're doing like his animation. Okay. <clears throat> You've got to help me out so I can finally make a, my dream a reality. I mean, I know what the dream is. So I'm happy to help. What kind of little maniac says, says yes to something with that? I think I said that in uh, Violet as well. Because I remember him saying that. So, there's something in my eye. Now, this might come as a surprise, but fact is, I'm all about the picnic life. The great outdoors. The perfectly prepared sandwiches. All of them. Not half bad at cooking either, I can tell you. Right now, I'm searching new recipes that'll help Pokemon feel better. Real health food, see? I really hope that this is recording correctly, because I got something in my eye and I, you know. I found this book the other day, and it had a section about Herba Mystica things. Basically, there's some kind of special herbs that heal up any Pokemon as soon as it eats them. Now, there are a total of five different types of the Herba Mystica. Mystica. Uh, just taking a little lick of them once they've been powdered will get the blood flowing. Provide nutrients. Prevent aging. It'll even boost the immune system. Damn, hold up. Let me get a hold to that. These herbs seem like they're the real deal. Only found in Paldea and Raider Boot. I think that's what he said. <laughs> But this book says they're all guarded by a titan Pokemon, meaning that it's going to be pretty tough to try to grab even a few, a few sprigs. Because see, titans are, well, I think they've got to be things like this. Okay, yeah, Rampardos, right. I think that's Rampardos, I don't really fucking know. As we descend further into the Area Zero, we began to catch glimpses of mysterious Pokemon. Though we wondered if these huge ferocious beasts were indeed Pokemon at all. One of our teams suffered a brutal blow from such a beast and was mortally wounded, forcing us to retreat for a time. Uh, a member of the survey team captured this photograph. By chance, I noticed a passing resemblance to the Pokemon Donphan. Donphan, that's what I mean. Uh, yet, differences uh, such as its sheer size and the shape of its back set it apart, as it do its great tusks. I... Ridding is not in a, uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I really want to get those herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. Now you help us out. Uh, don't have any friends with strong Pokemon that lend me a hand either. And I'd never hear the end of it if I went crawling to that student council girl. Bro, we're about to have a busted team, by the way. But here you waltz up. You've got, uh, you've got to help me out with this. You'd be perfect. Let's do it, bro. I'm willing to help Arvin. After playing Violet, I do like Arvin. So, it's whatever. Nope, wait. I don't need an answer yet. I'll just register the places where it seems uh, there might be Titans in your map app for you. It's got a Flabebe uh, case. Okay. Care to explain? Alright, so these are the Titans, which is like a little side mission that we'll get. I look really tired. In, in the recording of this, but uh, these are the Titans in the Path of Legends side quest. These are essentially like the little 
second quest that we have along with getting all the badges getting the bases done uh, for team star so there's a lot more to do in this uh let it stew for a bit and we can get more into the details later and in the meantime take this a little gift for listening and all a bag of stardust we can sell that on the to the black market you know what i'm saying but low prices Give the idea some serious thought, please. All right, cool. Now we're gonna go talk to Namona and, uh, well, hold up. We're gonna talk to Namona and she's gonna give us access to um, the gym badges. This is Kiriko, correct? I hacked your smartphone so I could talk to you. Hope you don't mind. My name's Casopia. I think that's how you say his name. But I never mind. Uh, but never mind that. It's you I want to talk about. I hear you're a trainer with a serious potential. If that's the description, if that description is accurate, there's something I'd like to ask you. Tell me, Kiriko. You know about Team Star, right? Yeah, of course. Great. I appreciate you being up front here. Team Star is a group of troublemakers formed by some academy students a while back. They cause headaches for the school and try to bring other students down to their level. And I refuse to sit idly by and let them get away with it. I mean, shit, what you gonna do? You gonna blow up the, the shit? So I've come up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. I call it Operation Starfall. But I'll need allies to carry out this operation, and I'd like you to be one of them. Bro, let's do it. That's another one of the side missions. Um, this is a set I didn't realize when I was playing Violet, but this is a pretty important part um, of the game as well, just like the Titans, just like the gym badges, but I don't think I read that. But until then, I'll leave it up to you. Bye. Probably not gonna keep that voice for the whole playthrough just because I'm not gonna remember that shit. Oh, uh, Miss Kubrick. I always give the older guys a wise voice, kind of like this. Please do try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? I'll be more careful. I don't fucking... You don't want anyone else overhearing any personal information after all. Look at Boisel hitting that shit. Or getting that shit. Yeah, whatever. Honestly, there are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. On you go, then, young lady. Deuces, bro. Team Star, you say? Now I know someone has me fucked up. Alright, so now Nimona is gonna tell us about the Pokemon. Actually, hold up, can we... We didn't talk to Nimona. Uh, we'll be right back. She's over there talking to somebody with cool hair. Very well, Champion Nimona. I trust you to handle this in my stead. Steed, stead, steed, stead, steed, stead. Sure thing, you can count on me. In fact, I bet this is gonna be fun. Hey, look, Poach, anyways. Um, I'm glad to hear it. Good day, then. Bro, they straight up, like, that's straight up Poochie, bro. Does he even have a role in this game? Oh, pardon me. He's secretly trying to, you know what I'm saying? Get the damn the, the 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 key words from us oh kiriko hey she looked awesome she did she has some cool hair bro good eyes she sure is that lady is well they call her la primera la primera i think that's how you say that she's strong she could do pretty much anything she's got cool practically coming out of her ears she's basically everything i want to be or that any Pokemon trainer would want to be, really. So be yourself, you know? Uh, oh, which reminds me. Remember in Homeroom when I asked you what your dream is? I said you're all about completing the Pokedex. No, no. I know you said... Yeah, but hear me out. You should try to reach the champion rank like me. Yeah, I will. Oh, wow. Hang on, though. I've got a whole spill I want to give you. Here goes. The trainers who reach champion rank are the ones who raise their Pokemon really strong. They're, they're pro tier battlers. Their moves keep 
crowds absolutely on edge of their seats. You have to prove yourself to the Pokemon League to officially get the title of champion. And to do that, you have to do more than just take classes here. You've got to take on eight Pokemon gems in so you can collect their gym bad or badges, badges, badges. <laughs> Once you've done all that, all that's left is the special test, the champion assessment. And once you pass that, then a long last you'll be a champion. Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming we're going to be like close to level 70 completing this game. Um, it's every Pokemon trainer's dream. The coolest title anyone could ever hope to get. Not to brag or anything. I reached champion rank during our last treasure hunt, you know? Oh, the treasure hunt is a special and independent study thing uh, we've got here. Should happen soon. Our last one started not long ago after the beginning of the school year. It's great. You'll get to leave school to go have an adventure and learn however you want. I guess you could say my journey to becoming a champion was a treasure I found, maybe. I don't know. I don't know yet. If that's the answer I'm looking for. Well, I know what I'm looking for. All the gym badges and all the glory. And all the tears of my... Uh, Victims. Enemies. Alright. Anyway, I've got a feeling I'd be able to uh, get even stronger uh, if you were working to edit. If me and you were to be working at it. I think that's what you said. Uh, let me go ahead and save the gym's locations in your map app in case you decide to go for it. You already know I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go to be the very best. I'm going to uh, beat the damn... What's that shit called? I'm going to beat the damn Pokemon League's ass. Um, and then I'm a shit. Try to catch them all. Oh, how the hell does she look like in the background? What's she talking about? Give us some thought. All right, cool. So that should have covered. Here, can we? I'm about to say, can we talk to Poochie real quick? Hey, Riola just made a noise. Uh, calling Miss Kiriko to the director's office, please. Once again, Miss Kiriko to the director's office, please. I'm about to say, I was about to go outside so I can do this Poke Portal shit, but let me talk to Poochie real quick. Does this dude. Salva... Salvatore? Well, thanks for coming. Save. Nah, I'm cool, bro. Uh. Director's office, because that's the only place we can go. This will be the last thing we. Pretty sure the last thing we do. A lot of dialogue, y'all, before we actually get some, you know what I'm saying, some progress made in this game. Thank you for coming, Miss Kiriko. Have you been enjoying your time here at the Naranja Academy? Of course. Let me take a sip of my, of my cream soda. This is the most wonderful to hear. That is most wonderful to hear. Now, you may be wondering why would we, why we could not have simply conversed earlier in the cafeteria. But let me assure you, there is a reason why I asked to meet you here. It seems that a friend of mine has a rather serious matter they would like to discuss with you. Who are you talking about? Oh, no. I'm afraid they actually aren't here, aren't actually here in this room with us. One moment, please. Just allow me to connect us. Oh, the, uh, uh, yeah. The, uh, professor, right? Hello, Kiriko. It's nice to meet you. My name is Professor Sada. I carry out Pokemon research within the great crater of Paldea. She's got to have a greater call. Like, is there a boss battle with her? Like, a some kind of battle we could do? Because, or some kind of side mission after we beat the game? Because the professors serve, like, no purpose other than talking to you every time you complete a Titan. Uh, nonetheless, let's just continue this. Uh, research with the great crater of Paldea area. Error, area zero. Damn. Okay, yeah, this thing. Uh, I got really dark just now. This is professor. Uh, this professor is in fact a graduate of our fine academy, as well as a splendid researcher. Well, allow me to get straight to the point. Kiriko, student number 
805 C3. Bro, I gotta put. I can't cover. I can show my ID. You are a student who travels with unusual Pokemon, Coridon. Is that correct? Correct. Thank you. I appreciate that you were honest and confirming the confirming the facts. I ain't got no reason to lie. Uh, not that I. Wait, I don't mean to offend you. In fact, I wish to ask for your assistance. <laughs> with what? Getting right onto his full experience. Well, it's full, full potential. That's what I meant to say. Oh, how good to see uh, that you're well. It's been quite a while since last we met. Gias. Karidon was once in my care, you see. I don't know why I'm talking like this for her, but... Uh, it's Pokeball was originally mine. I assume you received it from a young man called Arvin? I'm no longer in any position to be able to manage that Pokemon myself. This is what I would ask of you. Will you continue looking after Karidon on my behalf? Of course. I do appreciate your agreement. Karidon has been greatly weakened and is currently incapable of battle. It can, however, take a, on a form specialized for mobility. In all likelihood, it will require some time to fully regain the capabilities it once had. I'll provide you uh, with my contact information if you would please get out your phone. Oh, of course. Let me see. Go ahead and put your number in. Let me lock you in. Uh, I will be in regular contact going forward to keep tabs on your status. Okay, cool. Appreciate it. That was quick. They need to have something like that in real life. Just hold my phone over your phone. You know what I'm saying? Bling. And give me your number. Until then. Well, I guess that would actually be kind of bad. You'd walk past somebody and get somebody's number. Or somebody would ask for your number and just put your phone on the... Yeah, it... Of course... There probably should be more into it than just put your phone on top of the phone. Anyways, could this Pokemon have its origins within Area Zero? Whatever Area Zero is, yeah, most definitely, now that I see that. Sada, don't tell me you actually did it. Don't know what she actually did, but let me turn this light on because I look depressed. Dark. Well, it seems that Professor is asking quite the favor of you. But of course... Uh, the Academy is always here to support you in any way that you're able. I do hope you'll continue to enjoy uh, the school life together with Karidon. Of course. Now let me get the hell out of here, bro. Alright, that's actually all we're going to do for this episode. Um, we got a pretty good amount of uh, dialogue knocked out. But pretty soon we're going to be taking on badges, titans, and bases. So if you guys enjoyed, stay tuned for more. And as always, y'all have a good one.